वेलकम बैक गाइस सो इन माय ट्यूटोरियल टू आई हैव शोन यू हाउ टू रिमूव द एरर व्हेन यू आर गेटिंग नो मैचिंग टैब इज फाउंड सो दैट इज वन वे ऑफ डीलिंग विद द एरर्स व्हिच यू कैन सी इन लेक्चर एरर एरर हैंडलिंग एंड आई गॉट सो मेनी कमेंट्स वेयर आई हैव टू मींस देयर वेयर दे हैव टू Uh, deal with the same error but after, even after resolving uh, the given solution uh, they are not able to uh, resolve the issue so it may be because of a different issue which i will show show you now so that is related to browser issue correct so in case uh, if you have already gone through my video uh, that error handling uh, in that uh, i have shown you that how to remove no matching tab error using wild card entry that is using the star mark so in this one i will show you that even after doing so your uh, issue is not getting resolved uh, you have to do some changes in your browser so for that what you have to do i will show you so right now if you will see i have created a module and demo webshop login and this is the url launch these two are there they are very basic and in this i have taken my browser uh, scan from using edge as as browser i have taken to scan it so there is first thing which you have to uh, deal with is uh, you have to first make sure that whatever browser you are using the same browser need to be open when you are running your test case suppose you have scan your uh, elements using access scanner uh, in edge and when you are executing uh, your uh, uh, test case uh, it is launching uh, you know it is launching google so in that way the web element there are high chances that your web element will not be identified uh, because you have uh, scanned it using the s so in that case no matching tab error uh, will be found so let me open the uh, demo web shop so i will show you that uh, what uh, how we can deal with it so if you will see this is my test case and i am going to run it so if i will run it it has open in edge hmm correct so the browser is launch and we got the error correct so if you will see it is saying could not find html document demo web shop with the following properties titled demo web shop so i will uh, what i will do is uh, i will go to go to test case and i will go to open url if you will see here this is our details which we have given mm, the other details which we gave and in test configuration if you will see under browser chrome is given but as i told you i used uh, this uh, scan uh, of the web driver using my edge so if you will see i have chosen chrome as my tcp so it will uh, give error if the web element will not be found so i will change it to edge and save it make sure you have saved it otherwise uh, it will not work so now let me cancel this one and cancel this one as well so if i will run it now using as
the edge browser has opened it will log in and email id password and click on login so the test case is successfully executed so if you will see your report all the uh, test steps are successfully executed so this is because i have used the same browser from where i used for access scan now again i will go to open url just to make sure that how to change uh, from uh, google to edge and edge to google or any other browser this is the way we have to do it and i will show you that uh, the uh, uh, how to deal with the error uh, if this kind of error you are getting then basic thing which you need to do first so suppose what i will do firstly let me show you how to do it so from where you will find this particular one so you have to right click on your test case this circle one is test case and this double arrow these, these are test steps symbol so you have to click on your test case right click and you will see here tc is given when you will click on tc here you will get parameter so in parameter you have to choose browser and then your value as uh, whatever the browser you want to uh, whatever the browser you want to use okay so now again i will go to chrome so see because i have used x scan for uh, edge it will not work but as i have changed the browser to chrome at least it should open the google so in that way you will understand that changing the browser is working fine or not and also it is not necessary that in one browser if you have done the x scan uh, in other browser it will not work it 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 is it is there are chances that it may work because it will work until all the web element will relate because suppose a web element uh, present in uh, chrome is available in edge also so it will work but the time it will not match it will show the error so that is also one thing so let me run it <coughs> see the um, google has opened and it will log in because that web element is matching now it should show error somewhere it is not showing error that means all the web elements are matching okay or maybe let me restart the tosca commander and after that we will see uh, if it's running in chrome or not so let me cancel it and restart it again okay guys so i have restarted my uh, commander and let me show you that uh, we are using chrome okay and now i will i will try to start it run it sorry so if you will see the run has started So guys, uh, we have restarted the system and we are doing all the steps again to see if everything is working fine.
so our execution is failed here see this kind of error we are getting so you can understand that firstly we have to focus on which kind of browser we are is scanning and after that uh, uh, while opening uh, through execution which of the browser is opening so if that is fine then only we can go to other kind of debugging the error so I think uh, you got my point that how to debug the basic issues uh, and then if those issues are fine then go for the advanced one so these are the two errors of uh, handling uh, which we have dealt with so that's all for today thank you all